Hello, I'm here with Chris from Audinate. Chris, I've seen the boards saying Dante spoken here. Do they now also need to say Dante seen here? <laughs> That's a great observation, yes. Absolutely. We, we have been working on bringing video to the Dante family for quite some time. And I think what we're seeing at this show is just that continued momentum of, of bringing brands into the family and starting to launch products using the Dante AV brand. Um, at this show, we have over 50 manufacturers now who've signed up to use Dante AV and products are starting to make their way out to the market across the AV Ultra and the AVH brands, along with AVA. So we're seeing really good momentum, and I think it's it's absolutely true, yes. Yep. Dante's seen here. Now, transporting signals over IP networks is nothing new, right? What's the Audinate difference? What sets Audinate apart yep. from the competition? Yeah, well, look, we've been working on doing AV over IP for 15, 20 years. Mm -hmm. So we pioneered that, that, that path towards IP for the audio market. We're doing that uh, now with video and bringing the two together into something that an end user really wants to you know, have in there in terms of their user experience. So they have been saying to us for a long time, why can't my video mm -hmm. just work like my audio? Right, and so that's that's part of the momentum uh, that we took into the video space was that, that that demand for the same user experience. Now that's what we're known for. It's very easy. Plug it in. It just works. It's reliable. It's it's there. Uh, we want that same experience to continue on. We will continue doing that, uh, you know, for forever and a day. But I think over time, we'll be adding more and more to the solution that allows us to take advantage of the fact that there are thousands and thousands of Dante products out there, uh, hundreds and hundreds of manufacturers that give an end user like complete freedom of choice. They, they, can, they tell us all the time that they want freedom of choice of product. They value that interoperability that we bring, and that's, that's, our, that's our core value that we yep. bring to the market. So you'll see that continue to grow, uh, and as we add to that over time, um, it'll, be, yeah, it'll be exciting. Zooming out a little bit and looking at the wider tech industry, right? We've seen the migration to the cloud be accelerated, but here in AV, right, we're still kind of on prem, yep. as they say. Um, what do you think about migrating to the cloud? Is that something we need to start doing? Is that something we need to start thinking about? Yeah, look, I think that is absolutely a trend. You'll see a, a rise in cloud-connected management platforms uh, across this hall when you when you walk around. And just as you know, 15 years ago, moving the audio signals onto IP was a challenge. I think the next logical evolution is to connect those networks to the cloud and take advantage of all of that compute and the capability that's out there. So we're, we're working very heavily on that, both in terms of the media signals with Dante Connect, uh, and also a new platform we're bringing uh, over the coming months you'll see called Dante Director, which is currently in beta, and that's about allowing those devices to connect into a cloud management platform and giving uh, integrators and, and OEMs access to APIs that, that they can then rely on being there and present. So it's very exciting. I think the, the, the future for that, that cloud connectivity is very bright, and it'll provide a lot of value for, for people building on top of Dante. Chris, thank you so much for your time. Cheers, thank you very much.